Hello and welcome back to our channel. I am Farwa and you're watching Ninja Iraqi Dinar News YouTube channel. Hopefully you all will be fine. Let's start today's news. The exchange rates of the dollar decreased as stock exchanges in Baghdad and Erbil closed on Sunday. The dollar's prices dropped, reaching 162,500 Iraqi dinars for $100 after the closure of al Kifa and al Harithiya stock exchanges. This is a decrease from the morning rates, which were at 163,000 diners for $100. Our correspondent pointed out that selling prices in currency exchange shops in local markets in Baghdad also decreased, with the selling price at 163,500 Iraqi dinars for $100, while the buying price was 161,500 dinars for $100. In Erbil, the dollar also experienced a decline, with the selling price reaching 162,750 diners for $100 and the buying price at 162,650 diners for $100. Experts are optimistic about the prospects for an agreement between Baghdad and Erbil on the oil file for the Kurdistan region. Oil expert Gorfid Sherwani said that the visit of the Federal Minister of Oil to Erbil on Sunday reflects the seriousness of the Iraqi government. The visit shows that the two sides are ready to discuss the tactical, administrative, and financial aspects of resuming oil exports from the region, Sherwani said. He added that the main disagreement between the two sides is over the vision for the oil law. The Kurdish government wants to maintain its autonomy, while the federal government wants more control. The Constitution guarantees a clear role for the federal government, the regions, and the oil-producing provinces, Sherwani said. We hope that this will be taken into account in the distribution of responsibilities for managing the oil file. Sherwani also said that the estimates for the cost of oil production in the region vary. The federal government estimates that it costs $1.12 per barrel to produce oil and $1.7 per barrel to transport it. The Kurdistan regional government estimates that it costs $1.24 per barrel to produce oil and $1.8 per barrel to transport it. These figures are realistic and are in line with what is paid to foreign companies that sign a contract with the Federal Ministry of Oil, Sherwani said. That's it for today's news. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. Until next time, this is Farwa from Ninja Iraqi Dinar News, signing off.